is behind you? Yeah, you know, um, you know, all those guys over there, the whole organization, you know, especially the guys on the team. Um, it's always good to see familiar faces. So, um, you know, I grew good friendships. You know, I was only there for a couple months. So I grew, I grew some good friendships over there, and um, you know, some lifelong, lifelong friends and um, the coaching staff. You know, people in the office, everybody from from top to bottom, and they're awesome over there. You know, when you guys are playing with different combinations as you are now with Darren in the uh, situation yourself, still fairly new, can you tell the average fan how long it takes to really acclimate yourself? Man, it's, it takes a while, you know. Um, I mean, obviously, everybody knows we have we have very good players on this team. We have a full roster, but uh, that doesn't mean we're going to win every night. You know, we, we still have, we still have a, a lot of practice we have to go through a lot of sets you know like Darren's only been here for a few days and you know he, he's our starter tonight so um, yeah, I don't think it's fair to, to, to judge you know so fast you know it, like I said we, we've only been together a few games you know we had a couple guys out tonight but you know um, we're gonna be ready to play every night you know we just didn't have a, a lot of juice tonight but you know we'll be ready to play on Monday. Having played with Magruder um, do you have any take on um, I didn't honestly. I didn't see it. Um, I mean, I was kind of like just trying to play. I just saw him dunk the ball, and I kind of just went the other way. So um, I'm not really sure what happened. Um, I just, I, I just know, you know, Rodney is a is a tough player. You know, um, very physical on defense. Um, I had nothing bad to say about him. So uh, you know, he's he's a tough guy, and you know, I'm not really sure what happened. But um, you know, I hope it wasn't anything, you know, extra. Because I, I know him personally, he's a good guy. How excited are you to see this entire roster healthy and ready to go? Oh man, I, mean, I think we're all excited. You know, obviously, um, you know, even myself. You know, myself, um, the other D will. Uh, we all, we all still need to get acclimated in, in our in our spots. You know, like I said, I'm, I went from four positions now to playing three uh, when we got D will. So I still got to learn, you know, the positions at, at two or three different spots and defensive schemes. And you know, with K Love, Jr., you know, Brian. Um, Kyrie, when those guys come back into the lineup, and we add Bogut, so it, it's just a, a lot of a lot of different guys, and we just got to figure it out, and we'll be all right. Was it surreal at all to come back here relatively quickly after you know you changed and you almost have a different life now? Yeah, no, it's a uh, man. Everything happens for a reason, you know. Um, you know, with the ten days, uh, the two ten days, and then all, then with me signing on the day that we play the Heat. So I mean, everything happens for a reason. Um, you know, if like I always say, there's 29, there's 30 teams. You know, if one team doesn't want you, there's, there's going to be 29 other teams so um, that are always watching and you know that, that might want to give you opportunity. So I, I just took, um, you know, they gave me an inch and I took a mile. You know, that's what I want to do every single time, every single time, no matter what position I'm in. That's what I want to do.